The jack of all mental disorders. Jack of all trades. Once you have this disorder, you have every other you have every single other disorder. Or maybe some of them. Or maybe a set of them. But basically once you have this, you have everything. Schizophrenia. Now this one this disease that's just so damn much of an epidemic. Uh, with this mental disorder you don't know what's real what's real or what's not real so now for instance you know make up some sort of story like uh, basically like oh aliens are about to attack the world or oh God is going to attack according to end of the world 2011 is the end of the world or Oh, I wish, how much I wish I could be like a video game character that I have, or movie star. Oh, how, I wanna be like, I wanna be like that hero, superhero. Now, this thing, you lost touch with reality. Now, this has already broken by a lot of things. Usually when there's a kid who just you know, stuck playing video games and he just gets sucked into them. But you know, that kid's probably wanting to go hang out with other people, hang, hang out with friends. But he can't. Because most likely he has a psychotic parents who just, Oh no, you can't go over there. Because then they're going to go ahead and rape you and all this stuff. Maybe you should go with the kid and figure out, find out the parents. Talk with them, hang out with them. Find out about the pa parents. Find out about them. Make friends with them. But you don't. So the kid's gonna be stuck there. And he's gonna be playing video games. And then next thing you know, there's this thing where there's this thing where what's on news on the TV. If TV. And oh, you know, there was this one kid who. What's it called? The one kid who. Who was just you know was abuse was uh, attacking his mom. Who would just go around with a knife and just. He was swinging around or something like that, but he was like abu he was, his son was abusive to to the mom. Turns out, mom did it to him. Mom was abusive to him. And she said, "Oh, you know, he's like this. I don't know why he's like this. Because I'm not telling the truth that I'm the one who abused him." So then he goes hey, and takes on his anger on him, anger her, because you know he's just staring on the TV all the damn time. Watching the TV and then when it's turned off, you get spooked, pissed off. I wonder why. Well, maybe because you know he's watching the damn TV obsessively because he has nothing to do. He has nothing better in reality. He has nothing better in his life. And once you turn, once the parents turn off the TV, he goes psycho. Obviously, because he just took away the one thing that he has. And now he just got obsessed over. Sadly. Now we're going with. So now there's different types of schizophrenic. There's a multi-personality schizophrenic, which basically, uh, you know, that multiple personalities, like for instance, you go to one personality, then you go to another, they go into one personality, and they're just talking, you know, normally. And they go to another personality, and then they're just talking, and they don't know what the hell happened before. Which is again, not facing reality. You know, there's something so traumatic that happened to you, and you're not, and there's something so damn traumatic to you that's still killing you, and then you're just consecutively being killed by it, destroyed by it. Maybe because you're stuck with the whole fact that you don't have anything, you don't know what the hell to do anymore. And so you, once one, so you remember. You switch to the other personality. And you switch to the other one. I try to use this against me. Sadly, who I am, I cannot be myself. So I have to be those one of those three. Cause they know, they know what's going on. And I'm just kept myself from a lot of different things, and I'll probably explain more about myself, about me. And then we have the famous psychotic schizophrenic 
Now this one's so obvious because it's a number one first one that's gonna be diagnosed. It's gonna be fi figured out with. No, psychotic schizophrenic is, you know, this person who's just a psychopath, who just whatever he does, he would he will want to kill someone. He will kill someone. Like he he will not take what uh, China is. He will take advantage of it. And he will just abuse of it. He'll take advantage of any power that he has. He will take advantage of it. How does that sound familiar? Hmm. Me religious people take advantage of, you know, oh, because I, because I have the Lord watching me and all this stuff. I can go ahead and murder people. Let's get to Frank. And then how there's other people, like, oh, you know, I have so much power, I have so much money and all this. The word is going to go ahead and pass the, they're just going to go ahead and instate a bill, a bill that's going to censor the internet, which we have SOPA and yeah, the SOPA and the Protect IP bills which are still passing because you know these lobbyists are just going psychotic and putting whatever money it is and people go crazy with power they're going psychotic because all the cameras whatever the hell they want they just care about having as much money as possible they're consumed by their own hatred, their own anger and I'm seeing anything in reality wait a second wait. No, because we want more and more and more. They get greedy, they get selfish and all that. No matter what, you ask them what the hell they want, they, they will not be able to answer that question. So they just keep going for the money. You're going for more and more and more. They say, oh, you know, you're stealing. You're well, maybe if there was money into the... Maybe there was a way that there was money into the damn... U.S. It's something to stimulate the common economy. But again, you know, these people have so much billions and billions of dollars. I'll just donate to some sort of charity instead of just actually paying taxes at least. So that when you pay taxes, at least you help out the damn economy. Not having the poor in the middle class having to pay all the damn taxes and then struggling and suffering all the damn time. And they have these psychopathic parents who just go lunatic and crazy because they just get consumed by their own anger or hatred. And yet, oh, let's just take it all on each other. In reality, there's this higher authority, there's this higher people who, higher class who have so much damn money, yet they just keep it to themselves. You know, we have the, then we have these lobbyists who just pass a stupid bill, stupid bill like that, and these other ridiculous bills that make no sense. And they put in as much money as it, into it. Psychotic schizophrenic. And another thing too, which is another way how you could explain schizophrenia as well, thinking outside the box. Now, there's someone who, for instance, they're doing, you know, they're going around doing everything for the mom, whatever the mom tells them, or whatever the parents tell them, or whatever, whatever, whatever else is it. They're following it. They're following without even thinking whatever, say, religion as well, you know, Christianity, Catholicism as well. Science as well, they follow it with no matter with nothing, with not even thinking it, but they just follow it because it's just going. And then whenever someone goes ahead and starts questioning these things, starts telling them, no, that's wrong. This is why and all this stuff. Like what I'm doing right now, there's gonna be people that's gonna be, like, oh no, this is the truth. This is the number one thing. This is the perfect thing in the whole world. The perfect belief. So they're gonna be so damn consumed by it. And when you keep, when there's when you question it, then a lot more people question it. They get pissed off, and so they start taking their anger on you, and they start putting more bullshit and more bullshit after bullshit. It's stuff I learned on my own. Ironically, stuff I learned on my own. I didn't learn this from school. I didn't learn from from anything. I didn't learn from school. I didn't learn from any like bigger. Uh, who knows what the hell it is? I learned on my own question these things and then there's other people who actually have opinions as well who have wisdom as well and they go ahead and talk to them about it and they put give me their own insight you yeah, because we're all different at least made up thanks to these mental disorders you can diagnose with one you're rolling for life sadly because you're gonna be shoved with all these meds and then there's religion and all this stuff there's these crazy Christianity and Catholicism like Oh, you know, we're just gonna go ahead and f 
now face reality and we're just going to be consumed by whatever the heck this Lord is doing in all this yes and I'm sure I'm going to get insulted so much huh like oh you're just being possessed by the devil the only person I know that person is my mom just like you are being consumed by your own anger my own blind hatred not realizing wait a second we're not thinking logically about this Maybe there's something very odd about this. I mean, these people just lie and then make another thing up. Cause you know what? Let's just wait until this year ends. Let's see what happens. Once whatever it is that these cr Christians and Catholics are so so crazy about, oh, dude, this year is the end of the world. It's Judgment Day. This, year. let's see what happens. Cause no matter what. If it here to be exact date, exact time, er, it doesn't matter. Where is it gonna happen? Is it gonna happen over there where Tokyo and Japan is at? Well, I know you know the ball the same where Japan's at. All that section can happen in the U.S. Please tell me. Because if it happens in the U.S., it happens. Japan will be in the future of that same day. If it happens in Japan, the U.S. will be in the do, do U.S. will be in the past of that day so it will not be any exact date there is no way how that can be happening if you don't believe me on this, check the world clock please by all means check the world clock check the clock for over at Japan or any of the countries any of the countries nearby there then check the world clock for U.S. do any of those match any t at the same times one's gonna be ahead, the other's gonna be the past Now think about it. I mean, you have these lunatic moms, lunatic parents who just go so, so obsessed with no, no, you're supposed to do this. And they start screaming and acting like idiots and being consumed by all their hatred and anger. Are they religious? They're Christians, Catholics. Please tell me. Without that, then are they scientists? And they somehow, oh, we're a member of science. Science is our proper thing. Evolution. We evolve. I'm gonna go on more topic about science as well. As you can see, schizophrenic. Seems like they're everywhere. Those psychotic extremists, Christians, Catholics who just go around putting all this crap on you. Like, oh God tells you to do this. If you don't do this, then you're gonna go to hell. If you don't believe in him, you're gonna go to hell. If you don't tell someone else about this, you're going to hell. Now, like the scientists, are just, oh, you know. We need to put all these meds on these things. Oh, we're dying. We're checking on. Oh, there's gonna be probably some sort of impact, some sort of end of the world thing because you know a meteor is gonna strike. You know how there was that fear about that comment back then. Didn't happen. Then we'll go on to the next one.